In this lesson, we're going to talk about how you can use the filter function in Google Sheets. So in this example, we have an employee directory that has employee name, the department each employee works in, and the location that the employee works at. And in our first example, we just like to do a single criteria filter on our data set based on the value in this cell here for anyone who works in the IT department. So we're going to begin with the filter function. You can just type FIL and hit tab. Our first input is our range. This is the data set that we want to filter on. So I'm just going to select this first cell, hit control shift right arrow and control shift down arrow. Our next input is going to be our criteria range. So we want to filter on anyone in the IT department. So we're going to select the department range and we want to filter on anything that is equal in that range to the value in this cell here, the IT department. You can see this gives us the four people who work in the IT department. And if I change the value here, it will adjust accordingly. So now if we wanted to have multiple criteria, all you would need to do is hit F2 to go back into your filter and add another criteria range with a criteria. So we'd also like to get anyone who both works in the IT department and is located at the main office. So we'll select the location is our second criteria range and we want anything that is equal to the main office. So now you can see we get the two people in the employee directory who are both in the IT department and work at the main office. Now what if you had an OR condition? Well what you would need to do is enclose your arguments your criteria arguments in parentheses and use a plus symbol to add them together because what you're doing is you're essentially adding up the true values for both of your criteria. So as you know the numerical equivalent of a true when a match is found is 1, the numerical equivalent of a false is a 0. So this adds up anytime there's a match in one or the other or both of our criteria ranges 1 plus 0, 0 plus 1, or 1 plus 1. So how the filter function works is it filters on anything that is greater than a false value which is 0. So I'll hit enter and you can see this pulls back anyone who is either in the IT department or works at the main office or both. Hey, if you like what you saw today, please subscribe to the Excel Cave. Thanks for watching.